Oh. Spotify. Yep. Um, okay. There it is. Cool. And yeah. All right. Let's export. Yep. And then stream decker upload. Cool. All right, here we go. Um, so we have the enlightened tutor build here. Um, I think, I think the only card that I'm not like too sure about here is this one. Yo, good to see you, Dirk. I went, uh, running and I'm like totally sapped for energy. It is, uh, 95 degrees. Oh, cool. I, um... Things are going well. A um, little bit of an early start for me, so happy to do it. Um, I'm going to be out of town until Sunday. Sunday night, I might be able to stream. We'll see, but I'm uh, heading back to Philly for some like family stuff um, that I'm doing. Um, yeah, so I'm going to try this. I'm, like, trying fourth in the Saga build main deck. And I cut an Endurance and a Questing Beast to make it so. Um, I could see cutting Ren down a little bit, too. But um, I don't think I want to. Um... I'm a little soft on the cage in this meta. I've been seeing less like Tony Scapone decks and less like um I've not seen a ton of elves. So it makes me wonder if there's like something better than cage that I could run. Same with this maddening hex. Uh I think this card is like you only get this against Storm if you have, like, a million hours of time. Yeah, it's just Bowmasters. <laughs> it sort of is. It sort of is. That's fair. Um, yeah, I don't know. Just prep for Bowmasters. Like a carpet of flowers, maybe? I think I want a carpet of flowers. I think that's fair. By playing your Bowmasters? Okay. You're giving me the real answer. I'm just telling myself what I want to hear. I'll run a carpet. Yeah. Cool. So, um... I have a bunch of envelopes here. Um, many, many envelopes and, uh, some envelope. Uh, that's a boring envelope. But then this envelope isn't boring. So, uh, yeah, mail day, uh, round two. Um, cool. After round two, I'll try to remember. Punishing Saga. Oh, you are okay. I got a, I got a few. Foil polluted Delta, cool. Um, tor, uh, was it? No, it's not torment. Um, sorry, onslaught, right? Hey. 
egg of the sea. I think we care. We just don't care so much, you know. But um, it's been a little rough for me. I think my deck cares about it more with the Sylvans. Whoa. That's awesome. Check this out, though. Go, Ben. Yeah, that's that's one way to bolt the bird. Duress. Okay. Got to be combo. Oh, well, it's Doomsday. Okay. Yeah, for sure, Doomsday. They know about Endurance, too, which makes this more complicated. Getting me frustrated. Life's like this, you... Hey! Yo, good to see you, Derby. Um, top card sucks. I think we fourth here. And we do it off of a... Savannah. Go white, red, this... I'm trying. I'm trying to end this punk. Cutting the endurance says from my list is probably gonna hurt me a little bit. Yeah. I'm wondering if the knight was better than fourth here, because, like, wastelands. My. Yeah. Edge is definitely going in that pile. Yeah. <laughs> you can see it. Yep. Yeah. All right, pretend like we understand. Am I not seeing? Oh, Force of Will is gold border. Okay. Yo, Finn. So Edge, Street Wraith, one. I'm wondering if I just hit them for as much as possible and ignore the Wasteland. Because um, I could deal five to them this turn with the Ren. And um, I don't... I think I have any relevant. Just screenshot, yeah. I think I have a decent shot, though, to be honest. Okay, there. 
is. Um. One Street Wraith. Yo, good to see waterfalls. Um, I think the answer is deal five. And, um, I'm going to take four just because. So we go like this. Green, green, this, this. And then I'm going to uh, make the wasteland uh, a 3-3 three, three with vigilance. And then um gonna look at their deck for dazes here. It doesn't appear okay. One days, two days, three days. Okay, so I think they're on three days is pretty typical. Okay. So then now I'll waste them. Because I can. And we pass. Draw a bad card. And we hope to win here. Okay, so now Force of Will kills them. Okay. Song request. Cool. Well, they were at one. I thought it was safer to wait. Okay. So torpor orb needle. I like Teague, I like choke. Packed. Oh yeah. I didn't consider packed, uh Matt. That's a very good point. That would have been deadly. Are the canonist or any of these like worth playing? High star with the basic swamp question. I love it. Uh, just like the nuance, the detail. How's it going, I Star? It's great to see you. I don't see one. You think Silence is pretty good? Canonist and uh, Silence? Okay. Because there, there's a lot of duds in here. I think this is going to be a very hard game, too, though. Of 
Torpor Orb is like the card. Last question, 15 or 16? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Hard to tell. I, I'm seeing a uh, watery grave for what that's worth. Uh, high star. That doesn't. I don't know if that means anything to you. Um. This is a snap keep because of this card. I think I, I don't think they could win with that card in play. Just gotta hope they don't like duress it. So Um, I have no way to accelerate Torpor Orb. Okay, I star. Uh, I'll, I'll do a little research for you, I star. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen is what I count. I don't know if I messed my count up. All right, endurance. We have to have lands in hand, so there's really no telling. Um. 14 last game. Okay. Thank you. I don't think I can live long enough to play the Torpor Orb. So I think I just waste and pray. Yeah. Oh, shit. That's really rough. So, pretty bad. Can I survive a turn here? I'm gonna try it. I don't think it matters though. It mattered? No way.
Well, they have one in deck. I think I win. They have one in deck. How would I lose from here? Don't they just deck? I, I think I win. They have a uh, zero in deck. They have a uh, zero in deck. Um, yeah, let's go. That's good. <laughs> Glad I put the deafening silence in there, right? Holy shit. That worked. Wow. Oh, fuck. High star. I'm sorry. Doomsday, favorite match concerned. Uh, this was the exiled uh, again. But this is their sideboard plan. Uh, <laughs> I guess punishing Maverick with the um, with the Enlightened Tutor combo. There is some game. I will say that. Hopefully that, that helps you. But that's what they uh, opted to do, uh, this plan. Yeah, exactly. Good to see you, uh, Orca Ben. Uh, okay, cool. Let's get the uh, music going again. Thanks for the saw request. Nick Fit. Don't know what to make of that. Hopefully not Nick Fit. Looks like Nick Fit. That is Nick Fit. Okay. Yeah, I think it's going to be. I think they're going to therapy here. No. Fuck it. Okay. Pretty good though for me so far. Let's go Taiga at the moment. I don't think it, yeah. I think this only works for the, not the veteran explorer. Damn it, they hit land drop. Oof, that's fine. Okay. Um, I think this is a very easy night. Yeah. That's a 6-6 six, six already, too. Pretty big. Grist would be pretty annoying. I think that's my biggest fear. Just grist at hand.
That's what they name. Uh, for Green Sun Zenith, not a bad name. So now, there's no way they pass priority. I think I absolutely would. Um, okay. Yeah, fuck. Probably fourth here. Yeah, Ligma's terrifying. It's a good name. Uh, they named Endurance. Okay. So, um, it's an uphill battle here, but if I draw Zenith, I have a pretty good shot. Or Excavator. That is none of those. I think we just go uh, all in fourth here. Okay. You're back on Ligma, huh? Red, white, other, other, this. Okay, I am the monarch. Um, okay, bowmasters. That's pretty annoying. Um. I think I still waste here because they are going to get the Monarch no matter what, it seems. This is not an easy choice, but I think it's the right choice. And I think double black is the best one to waste them off of. Yeah, it is. Oh, there was another star request. My bad. Uh oh, Ben. No. Ben didn't have one. Uh Ben put a link in chat. Oh, okay. A mini Zeus. Thank you. Each player sacrifices a creature planeswalker. If you sacrificed a permanent this way, you may return a... Okay. So this is rough. Um, okay. Wasteland plan doesn't feel very lucrative here. I need to regain the monarch. Um...
I think I just got to go for the face here, huh? Go for face and pray. Um, I could kill the oof and attack. Is that better? I could float green here. Okay, sorry, quest. Uh, okay. This is pretty tough. Hey, good to see Ari. Um, the e tutor package today, um, not as spicy as last time. Uh, adding, um, what would it be? Uh, carpet of flowers would be like the spicier edition. Keeping in the uh, other cards as well. The um, gosh, I think I just shoot here. Keeping the um, the uh, craft diggers cage, which to me was like a little sus. Trying this. Yeah, it's definitely a sussy baka for sure. Thought the uh, yeah, I think you're right. What if they fetched Arbor though and group blocked it? That, that's what I was afraid of. Um, but yeah, I feel you. Doesn't feel great. Uh, a six man of planeswalker. Okay, uh, whatever the fuck this does. Uh, each opponent sacrifices a creature with the greatest power. Okay, son of a bitch. Sure. Uh, I guess there's a chance here, though. This is such a weird game. Ligma combo is eminent, I think. I think this is just a float. Because, like, this probably has to die. I'm not even going to read it. I'm just going to assume it has to die. Because don't nobody got time for that. So we do this. Um, we get a, uh, a haywire mite to hang back and do a block. We plus here. And then I think, all right, uh, just a moment here, team. Uh, we shoot. Got him. And then um, these nuts. So that goes bang. And then we go green, green for a secondary blocker. These nuts shot. Uh, terrified because they have six or seven mana in their deck. And uh, that probably means GG in most cases. Cool. Okay, next song. A little shanty.
Name Knight. Okay. Uh, that is regrettable. So if I would have got Soul Guide Lantern, I might have had a shot. But I did not. So I'm probably dead. Eugene... All right. I think fourth might be my best draw. Oh, man. Really needed them to have nothing. Ugh. The utility of Excavator is pretty darn low. So, Plow. I'm going to say no to that. That doesn't hit the tokens very well. You gain seven life, draw seven cards, and put seven permanent cards. Okay, that's fucking nutty, though. Can I even... What the fuck? It'd go to ten. Right. I, I think my best chance is to just try to go face here. I don't think I can deal nine fucking damage to that card. I think there's still a Savannah to fetch. Yeah. Yep. Okay, cool. I was nervous about that. Um, okay. This, this. Thank you for that. Okay. Go Shadow Spear. I think we just get back shoot here. Sort of think I hit the Ugin. Because that ultimate just 
Seems so fucking nutty. What the hell does the ultimate do? You gain seven life. You draw seven goddamn cards. All right, yeah, we gotta hit the fucking in there. I don't know. I don't know what I'm doing. Yeah, totally nutty. Am I about to get leg mud? Ligma. All right. I think I win that game if I get Soul Guide Lantern. But I did not. Creature cards. So that's not going to help me. I think this is worth it. Don't think Torpor Orb helps. Oblivion Ring is okay. Could see this being okay. This is okay. Out Lig Mad. Yes. I concur. This shuts off Green Sun Zenith, but, like, it also shuts off my Green Sun Zenith. Hmm. This is awkward. Maybe no Teague. Ring is pretty nice. You like Cage? It could hurt me too. Players can't cast spells. Okay, that's true. A hey, natural mystic. Thank you. Or hello there. Not thank you, but thanks. But hello. Um, I'm gonna trim two dorks here. Because I think I did see Bowmasters. Do you think you'd bring it in against um the Newton deck? I gotta mull this. Okay, let's try it. This is pretty bad, but um, hopefully still in the library just fixes all my problems here. Cool, let's give that up. Name Knight, not bad. So, we're in trouble. Could just be a uh, orc. Yeah. Against them, I think I'm going to... I don't think I need to take damage here. My two drops really suck, though, huh? What do I even have that costs two mana? 
Yeah, Moloch would be. Such a bummer. Um, I don't think there is a single two-drop in the deck. So, I think I'm going to say yes. So, bummer. Um, I want to shuffle. And we'll go plateau. It's a delighted halfling here. Another one? Oh boy. That's interesting. I think Boo is going to be pretty good here, though. So we definitely say no. Um. I think they group block it, but I'm not sure. My poetry is deep. I never fail. Half man, half amazing. Kind of cool here in Nas's like. All right, well, we're in big mega trouble. Don't think there's any way out of this. Eugene. I'd have to draw like another boo, and I don't even think that's going to do it. Yeah. All right. That's depressing. Don't know if there was anything else I could have done. Really? I'd like to hear that. I think it, um, the Grixis version's a little scary. Um, I like the Shadow version. Because I run Grove. Oh, shit. Uh, I'm going to show cards. Round three. I'm going to show cards. I meant to do it after round two. Oh, boy. All right. Against my better judgment, I'm going to keep a one lander. Because it has Sylvan Library. And another Mana Dork potential. So... Yeah.
That was pretty cool. Definitely hearing Nas's like was pretty cool. Cool, I had this the whole time in hand. I knew that was there. Don't. Bummer. So I deserve this. Oh, you got a saw too. Okay, gotcha. Um. Let me go noble. Cool. I think I got him out of order. I'll just pause this app, but I'll get your song going. So I, I don't want to forget. They had the one-two punch against me. They they plowed the dork, which I didn't expect. And then they uh, prismatic ending my card. So we are likely dead. If we draw a white land... I think we have a decent chance. Um, the line right now is Soul Guide Lantern Cantrip if I don't get a land. That gives me two chances to draw a land, which uh, is probably 50% chance or so. Yeah, we this might be a scoop. I'm gonna see more about their deck here, but I think it's uh pretty dead here. Target player draws two cards. Okay. Good for you. Man, when did Control Deck start play a wasteland? It's just such a weird format nowadays. Okay. That's my fault, though. I kept the shitty hand. I think a ring might be decent. And, uh... Yeah, but it had Sylvan. Famous last words. Plain Boston roll, okay. I think I could consider this against fourth. It hurts me though. Okay. 
Yeah, it's there's been a lot of old conventions that are being challenged nowadays. Um like Stifle in a control deck, Wasteland in a control deck. Yeah. That is true. You definitely don't want any dead cards. This opponent's going to go total mana denial. I could just feel it. That's their player tendency. And, uh... It's, uh... It shouldn't work. But I think it may. I just think it's, uh... Variants, more or less. But that's why I kept the mana dorks and pulled the plows. I remember uh, hearing this song and like a lot of it was like a meme where there'd be like some scary shit that would come up and the song would play. Bummer. Yeah, I think when you play green, it gives you incentives to consider Wasteland for sure. Loam uh, being one of them. Earl, I think, is another one. Um, I'll just say it's, it's new logic that is making those players do that. And, uh, I think it's, uh, not something you would have seen several years ago. Not saying it it's wrong necessarily, but it's, you never would have seen a wasteland out of a Tundra deck, like, historically. Unless it was, like, Patriot. It's kind of weird. White, green, colorless, this. That makes sense. Because of Caracas tech, okay. I'm not going to say wrong or right, but it's definitely unusual. Historically speaking. So I think if they're doing this right, they're shuffling their deck with this, and then they may brainstorm in response. That doesn't look like what they're doing. That's what I thought that would have meant. I don't know. Wondering, yeah. So yeah, this is just a sign to me that nothing against this opponent, but I don't think they're playing this too smart. Um, Knight is really good against uh, that. Uh, wait, actually, let's wait. That does complicate things a little bit. Yeah, this is not the TCL I thought it was going to be. I take that back. Let's drop this. Let's do this. I'll hit the sword, I suppose. Um, I think we plus here. Try to hit a land. We do not. Okay. I 
I am. Didn't realize that. I think they probably just had no other play besides playing Boo. So that's why. This Caracas is just like such a strong answer here, but. We shall see. You sure? Mad mind? I don't know. That's... Maybe they just don't play Legacy that much? That was a very weird play, right? Like, I'm trying not to be an asshole. Like, I, I really feel like I'm coming across as one. And I definitely don't want to sound like that. But that was a very strange play. Um, For... uh. You know. They're going easy on me. Well, uh, I thought about random map, but I didn't hit my land drop. Okay. Yo, freak. But yeah, I'll try to chill out a little bit. I feel like I'm coming across like a dickhead. A little bit of tilt after the, uh, whatever the heck it's called, the, uh, the game against Nick Fit. Um, and this player's really going after my mana, which maybe that's their only line. You know, but typically you don't see that out of a control deck. But hey, it's a new dawn, right? Twenty twenty three is a much different year. Hey, Didri. Hey, thank you, thank you, thank you. Yeah, fourth is super good. Maybe that was a part of their plan, though was to kill the Caracas with Wasteland and force me to get it. You know? Like, you never really know. And yeah, my mana does suck. That is true. Um, I thought of it as tech against fourth and um, boo. But it's pretty suspect, I'll admit that. 
It was that or like Swords to Plowshares or something. Um, the Enlightened Tutor version is going to have a lot less uh, action here. I think um, best card in this matchup is like Boo, Choke, and uh, My Own Wastelands. Geo fucking dude. What? Hey, Jared. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Um, ooh. You know what? That was risky. I shouldn't have played the Caracas. That was a mistake. Did he say stake? Um, I think if I could hit three here, I'm in good shape. Um, and I think because they play Wasteland here, I'm going to protect my uh, uh, fetch land here. Charm. That'd be brutal. The spell pierce, okay. The fact that they had to think about it means they probably did have the charm, I would guess. Um, I'm going to play it coy here. They're leaving too much mana back here for me to be comfortable. I'm reading the card. Okay. That's a good read, uh, Harry. Okay. Both. Um. All right. Not bad. Uh, 
Um. Yeah, that steal in the uh, carpet was unexpected. My hope is they like tap out trying to deal with the boo. And we get the muscles in there. But it looks like they're digging. So that's good news. If they tap out a white, it's tempting to go for draw four. They probably won't, though. Okay. Oh. Yeah. Hey, Strifo. Hey, right, here goes nothing. Dear Lord, guide this choke. Yeah. Oh, boy. Oh, stressful. All right. That feels really good. Um, sorry about the salt, gang. Definitely had some salt. Please clap. Uh, I'm going to try to be better. Uh, I just think... Uh, Losing to Wasteland is always frustrating, but then losing to Wasteland out of a control deck is, like, even more, like, tilting. Um, okay, I'm going to show off some cards, and then we'll get back to the game. Um, I will be better. Okay. Don't mind me, I'm living in a garage right now. Uh, my office has been uh, dismantled due to a flood. Uh, control decks play a daze, yeah. The ultimate tilt. All right, so no making fun of me, but I did buy a foil. Uh, uh deafening silence, Portuguese. I have a German foil choke. Just in time for that round. And then we're going to open something up. I don't even know what's inside this envelope. What's inside the envelope? What's this? A cease and desist? No, it's not a cease and desist. Uh, it is a card that is in between some tape. So this is probably not a very expensive card. French foil choke for twids. All right. Ooh, check this out. Torpor orb. So Japanese torpor orb. I thought I wanted a foil. Maybe not. I'm going to double check eBay now. Make sure. 
because that is definitely not a foil, but pretty cool. Foil might have been really expensive, actually. Hey, high star. I like the Portuguese language cards. Um. Oh shit, yo, Finn. You kind. We got Spy Man in the house too. Thank you, Finn. Thank you, thank you. French foil choke. Yeah. Um. That's a good question. Depends on what you like. I'm a proponent of play what you like. But if you want to learn the format and you want to win a considerable amount. Reanimate might be a good one. Delver, if you're into that style, that's a good point. Strifo. Deck's almost always going to be pretty good. Oh, I got Harry's favorite card. Here we go. We got a... What language is this? I don't even know. That's got to be German, right? Yeah. There's no way that's not German. Oh, it says German on it. <laughs> I didn't realize. <laughs> yeah, it even says German. <laughs> it was a little blurry at first, all right? <laughs> Got a few more, and then we'll get back to the games. But I'm excited for this mail day. <laughs> it literally says German, yeah. Yeah, I'm pretty sure that's English. At least the way I read it. Ooh, this is a good one. I forgot I ordered this. That is a Japanese grist. Not foil, though. But... Yeah... I don't play Grist that often, um, so I didn't want to get Foil, because it was like a lot of money, and I was like, eh, maybe I'll suit it up once in a while. Um, Alright, this one's the Restraining Order. So we're going to skip the Restraining Order mail. Got a few of those this week. No, I'm messing around. Uh... This is a cool one. Yeah. I like it a lot, actually. The uh, That version of the Christ. <laughs> Ubar blow me. <laughs> Welcome to jail. <laughs> oh, boy. <laughs> I don't know who that is, but uh, sorry you had a bad experience with Fubar. I don't know what that is. Um, well, this one doesn't tell you what language it is, but I know what language it is. A Schwerfell Kais Birch Bombi. Greek, yeah, for sure. That'd be cool if there were Greek cards. Pretty happy with this one, though. I haven't played this card in a long time. When Haywire Mike came out, it kind of took over that slot. I think that's all the mail. Is there, any, is there one more? No. The other one's actually a bank statement. I don't think that one's too interesting. You have some dollar dues. Yeah. That is the mail. Yep. Okay. Back to the games. Show us you want. <laughs> uh, cool. We're getting back to it. All right.
clean it up here. Pretty cool mail day though. I got some more uh some more uh cards coming in the mail too. Yeah, that's right. They came out I think there's even like a Hebrew card or something weird. Uh fuck. I'm going to keep it, but I'm pissed. Glory. Okay. Yeah. All right, let's play this. I think leading with wooded foothills is often a little more possible to be the Delver deck or something. So maybe leading with that wasn't smart. I don't know. Probably doesn't matter. All right, Sylvan Library, please. Korean's been so hard to find. That's one of my favorites. I think uh, Russian, Korean, and German typically are the ones I like the most. It changes, though, depending on the card. Like, um, I just like try to read the card out loud, and if it sounds funny, I like it. And the German ones often sound funny. Yeah. Korean just looks so cool with all the circles and stuff. I just think it looks good. And then I grew up in like a Russian neighborhood in Philadelphia. So whenever I see the Russian cards, I just always think like, uh, Sukobliet. It just always comes to mind. That beautiful string of sentences. Which I think translates to, uh, bitch fuck. <laughs> ah boy it's an 80 card deck um I am switch back here hmm thinking French is cool. German Borborgimos. That sounds cool. Borborgimos. Uh, Alright. I'm not playing the Saga yet. I have too much action in my hand. And Saga is just going to be a three mana. Or a card I never use here. French is pretty good. Do 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 Pharaoh. I like it. <laughs> Your opinion banned. Counter target creature spell. That was pretty cool. With great power comes a uh, great responsibility, Finn. Um. Okay. Hmm. 
What'd they get? Ponder? Okay. So we're going to hit Saga. I think. Hmm. A little awkward here. There's not much I could do. We'll do this. See what they do. And I'll go with the delighted. And then I'll waste that. Try to guarantee that I get the kill of the Nasset. Yeah, that might work. Like, oh, I got to kill this. My force of will. Yeah. So guideliner. Okay. That's pretty significant, actually. I feel like if they don't activate Narset, this is a day's undoing deck. If they do activate it, then I think I'm clear. Okay, I think it's a day's undoing deck. Pretty sure. Yeah. I think that's fair. So hit the Nasset. They plow it. No. Okay. Well, hopefully I don't get GG'd here. I gotta I gotta pick up the halflings too. I didn't pick them up because I couldn't find any cool ones that were reasonably priced. Japanese foil uh delighted halflings are like forty dollar e dues. It's at least what I saw. Yo four twenty. Good to see you, friend. Staff of thy storyteller. Sure. Um, Tough call here. I think it's Haywire Mite here. Play this. Um... Go to combat. Attack Narset. Attack Narset. Okay. Cool. That was a weird block. Both of them were going at Narset. I don't understand that. Pretty weird. 
Yeah. That was tough. Always hard to find those kind of cards. My guess is this is Cephalid Breakfast, by the looks of it. Playing 80 cards. Um, That's just my read here. It could be wrong. Um, I don't have, like, a scavenging use or anything great to search up. But yeah, that's my read here. They're a little stuck on lands, which is nice. Okay. Okay. Well, I hate that. Nothing I could do. I think they're playing it pretty well, though. I, I do want to give them credit here. Where is it? Yeah. Um, yeah. Oh, shit. That should have went at Tef. All right, I fucked that up. Whatever. One damage. Hopefully, I don't regret it. Mistakes were made. Um, trying my best to stay alive here because I, I am expecting the combo. Yes. You tell him, Big Shack. Get back, hockey cat. Are you allowed to say that these days? Different times, huh? Cool. It's out and he gets a pass. All right. That's fair. Mm hmm. I second that. I don't know what they could have here. I don't think anything, right? I think they just uh, accidentally had that happen. Red, green, this seems pretty good here. Thank you, Delighted Halfling. I second that. Yeah, that as well. That as well. Cool. Um, can I confirm anything about this deck? Sagas, Bluster Storms, Tef, Narset? That's a good question. That's the real question, Matt. That's interesting. I'm going to assume it's breakfast. I think.
Maybe I shouldn't, though. Yeah. Narset is a little weird. It was an 80-card deck, though. I think I'm gonna heed that feeling. Whatever. Words. Not gonna assume it's that deck. Heed that warning? Pay no heed? Yeah. It could be. I think I want these three. It really be like that sometimes. Um, okay. Collector Oof. Manadork. Manadork. I'll bring the needle in. Don't always split the difference. Yeah. I think I like this. Choke, carpet, needle, and a boatload of removal still in. It's like the removal is like, you know, could at least kill constructs. There's definitely something good about scooping early. I mean, it sucks having to scoop, but now I don't know what's happening. And if this was definitely breakfast, I bored a lot of cards in. So. Hmm. This hand functions. We keep it. Yeah, so, um, you know, uh, this hand, um, really, uh, his hand, and, um, you know, hey, Beto, thank you, we will never know, that's the advantage to scooping, and then scooping yet again. We will never know. So far in the saga builds, I do like fourth for what it's worth. Enlightened tutor board's been cool. Can't say good, but I enjoy it. Yeah, that was probably these games are going long and I have something else I want to do or have to do. I'm going to look them up. If it says reanimate, we keep. If it says Delver, we mull. Um, modern Yogmoth. I don't even know what Yagmoth means. Um, looks like a deck that's green, black stuff. Uh, yo, good to see you, Arnie. I don't know. I'm going to keep this stupid fucking hand and regret it. It's my destiny. It's my destiny. Keep a hand that's one land shy of being good. It's up there for me for sure, uh, Stripo. I 
I think Bowmasters might be better in the format, but fourth has more raw power. It's like um, brainstorm ponder format. So, wow. Okay, hey, I wouldn't argue with you, but uh. I get mad because it kills my mana dorks, and every deck that I play is not a stable mana base. So, that's my perspective. Leave my mana alone, please. So, this player played a decent amount of modern. Um recently too they won a monard prelim which is pretty cool I'm gonna risk it And I'm going to play the Soul Guide Lantern. And I don't know what I'm going to fetch here. It's definitely a green land. But I don't know what other color it's going to be. Yeah. I'm getting the this, this scam vibes just by the feel of the format. Forest is Forest is for fear. That's what the F stands for. It also is the responsible choice iron. I think you know, there's definitely a lot of reasons to get that. Waste. Sweet. Iron just being right. What's it like being right all the time? I think the, the hand was a trap is the big thing. I drew all my saga targets too. Which is like not great. <laughs> I think I should just scoop here. I just I can't I can't fetch anything. I I have to draw like a green land here. Alright, yeah, that's that's enough for me. Oh my god. <laughs> Alright. I knew better. I should have mold. That's what you get. That's what you get. Um, I think EE's worth bringing in, perhaps. Knees weak, arms spaghetti. Yeah, I second that. Yeah. Okay. Oof. Liberator. Probably the two dorks. Probably Haywire Might. So that gives me room for this. Um. I could try these. Just take out all the dorks and pray. Let's do it. Yeah. I think this is a keep, though. It has Sylvan Library, after all. Uh. 
Yeah, I I don't think I could ever cut library. I do think I'll fetch a basic here though. If I draw this, uh, yeah, I think it's gonna be a basic most likely. Hmm. Now I don't think I can fetch a basic. Because then I don't have red. Maybe I should, though. I think I still get a basic. I think I still do. Cool. Sweet. Library. Play Bowmaster? Yeah, probably. That's true. No rod. All right. That is fine with me. Oh, no, I drew the fourth. Okay. I will do this. Um, let's play this. I think I would sooner play the knight early. Cool. Do not go chasing punishing waterfalls. He does not take kindly to that. Yeah. Hey, Sniff. Good to see you. Yeah, we're F6. I probably shouldn't. That's against my nature. Oh, they were F6. Yeah, they were. And I would never do that. If you play Force of Will, I don't think you should ever F6. Just tell your opponent that they're good. But they did bring in Null Rod against me. Which is pretty cool because of the way that I played game one. Talk to me. Yes. I think even though it hits my life total, I think I just, this deck needs it. I don't think I take any more damage here. It's looking like that. Yeah, the other two. I agree. Let's see what they do. I'm hoping they wasteland my Savannah. That would be like a pretty cool thing to do. I guess he's challenging, you know. Um... Okay, one line, waste, waste. They waste Savannah. I activate Knight and waste. 
but I don't love it. I think... Do we waste black? Do we waste black source to force out waste on Savannah? Well, I think if I waste waste, then they do that. But I don't think they're going to just do that, you know? If... You know, it's like clearly a misplay, you know, if they try to waste the Savannah with an open night. So I think I'm going to force it. See what happens. Force the interaction here. And I, I think I'm going to play. But I want to tap my knight. I think this works. I think this is a smarty pants play. I would like to shoot the bow legged fella, the bow legged one. The bow-legged one. Oh. Okay. That's interesting. The Swamp Cycler, yeah. If they did have the Swamp Cycler, I think I played that smart. Merc Titan and yeah, I think so. I think it's going to be an endurance, especially if I draw a green mana here. Wonder what they're thinking about. Cool. Okay. We're in good shape here, I think. Um I think going the six is too risky. I really want the land though. So I think the answer is play the Endurance. So they... Okay. I could waste here. I kind of want to. Okay, let's do this. I think I'm so far ahead it doesn't matter. But I am going to waste the watery grave with endurance on the stack. 
That way I played around these. And then I get maximum value. And then the hope is to one shot them with knight and this. Bowmasters? Okay, that's a bow bummer. Um, all right, that actually is a really tough play for me to beat here. Um, I might have to take damage. Fuck. Yeah, I'm going to take two here. I think I have to, right? But what about this shadow? My, uh, I, I'm probably overthinking things. So we float. Let's get Shadow Spear. Let's fetch. For a white mana. Yeah, maybe you're right. I always struggle against this deck uh, with those kind of choices. Yeah. So the Null Rod is, like, pretty annoying here. Yeah, it is. I honestly think this game's going to go to clock first, though, the way it's played out. A snuff out. That's a pretty good read. Have to be careful here. So green this... Oops. This goes green. Yeah, I think they're going to go to time, to be honest, the way they're playing. I think I'm going to plus it for now, and I want to protect this land. Okay. The snuff out would be a pretty rough card to see here for sure. Um, okay. Under. Yeah, it's really snuff out. That's what I'm afraid of. Uh, Excavator is one of my favorite cards here, for sure. Yeah, and it's definitely a card they play. I think that's a really good read.
Ah. Got him. Got him. All right. Cool. I didn't even remember putting that card in here at the time. Um, let's see if I draw a pun. Yeah, that's true. You never know. Either they really are trying hard, or they're double queued, or maybe something else is going on in their life. You never know. It didn't say that, I don't think. Carpet. Uh, yeah, so we're just going to take that draw very happily here. No. Um, let's make my land drop. All right. Yeah, I think this slow probably needs something else, though, you know? Could be um a health issue, you know? Could be something like that. McDonald's Wi-Fi could be that. Yeah, that says they want a prelim. I'll take the Taiga and um, I'll attack for 12. Yeah. It's like, do I play around Wasteland or Snuff out here? Um, not gonna play this in the days here. I'm just gonna let them have a life. I think I'm going to give um we're going to say no to this for sure. Twenty twenty flyer would have been nice here. That's for sure. In this unique situation. No, I very 
briefly owned a max sa a mock sapphire, and I won it at Eternal Week or Eternal Extravaganza, the event that uh Mike Caffrey would run. Uh, no. Do this. Like, do I just play fourth here and go for it? I don't. I don't know if I have the the guts for that though. Let's just do it though. Yeah, maybe we do that. Okay, let's let's just make the thing. Cool. Now, because this is hexproof, I'm going to just leave that back. I think it's safer. Um, I think I'm going to plow here. Yeah. That's the plan, at least. I think I plow the orc army and a turn, and then I tap grove twice. I think that's the game plan here. <laughs> Dick move for sure. <laughs> All right, cool. All right. I I deserve to lose the game three for that. <laughs> All right, all right. We got to get serious here. Uh, not going to play the Bad of Dorks. Probably should be playing a second Delighted Halfling, to be honest. Yeah, thank you, Artie. That felt super good. <laughs> yeah, freak. That was the play. You saw it, too. Um, now this is decent. If this resolves, I ride off into the sunset, but if it doesn't, then we're in big trouble. Um, thought sees okay, so that that's gonna change the dynamic here. See a carpet.
<laughs> Bully Mark. It comes sometimes. I probably... I may not have done it if they weren't taking so long, that game. They get the basic. Best draw is definitely like, man. This card, you two for one yourself, and then you reanimate, and then it's like, okay. Kind of thought about leading with Grove, but they're aware of it. Okay, I think I chose right. Hmm. Glad I didn't lead with the Grove. Cool. Sylvan Library. Okay. So reanimate would be a little rough here. Um Yeah. On it for sure. They're going the long game here. This is another deck that's breaking legacy rules of like, if you're a tempo deck, you probably want to run a certain set of cards. Could be a uh, surgical here, which would be a little annoying. Um,. Gonna go for it here. I think I'd rather play around surgical than another discard. Cool. Um, I think I let them gain some life here. Okay. That's annoying, but fine. Yeah, I'm gonna let them gain some life. I think it's safer. Drawing the Soul Guide Lantern was really lousy. It's actually like probably the worst draw. Um, so we get Shadow Spear here. Let's let them gain life, play it. Um, I'm gonna hit the six six. Not waste. Yeah. 
Ain't it funny how the night moves? Yeah. Take a little bit of a thwomp in here. Another red source would be nice, for sure. Um. So if they play a land fetch, I may crack it, but... Yeah. Okay. I guess I wait just a little longer here, but good draw. Surgical would be a bummer here. Love the Jerry Seinfeld. All right. Do you have a surgical extraction? Appears not. Okay. And... I'll trust chat here. I think they're right. It's tempting. I didn't I have not seen a Murktide at all here, but it's probably in the deck, right? Yeah. I feel like if you're streaming or something, double queuing makes sense. But if you're not, I feel like that's just gotta be a ton of stress. I think you're right, Iron. All right. Plow's pretty good. Um, yeah, let's do it. Yeah, they're going to get a clock here. Looks that way. All right. Um, I think it's safer to just do this now. So they hit the sword here. Sure. Does that have trample? I don't think it does. No, fuck. And fetching was a big mistake. Shit. Okay. I think I can win this game, though.
I thought I had Arbor. Race down the block, do an 8 One, two, three, four. Yeah. Cool. I think I got this. Neat. Um. Bam. Bam. Cool. Oh, shit. Sorry, yeah, I gotta run. If I would've known. Sorry about that. I, uh... Today's an early day. I never follow those. That was pretty cool. Raid the pit? Yeah, that's an easy raid. Before I raid them, I just wanna see if there's, like, just some young scrappy... Getting started, because I love the pit, but I always try to... There's like a handful of people that I'm like... Trying to get them some exposure. But... That looks like a... That does not look like a legacy deck. That looks like a modern deck, I think. Let me see. Yeah, this looks like modern. Okay. Otherwise, I would have raided this small streamer. Um. Yeah. yeah. Thank. Thanks, Freak. Thanks for stopping by. Uh. Definitely enjoy your content too. Check out Freak You Nasty for Legacy and Modern. Um. Good streamer. A nice setup. Audio sounds great enjoyable content 10 out of 10 would watch again yeah great seeing you carador iron with the good plays ccd smash keep playing unfair you crazy sob northern good to have you back here my friend uh fucking killer switch high star really uh magic dad magic f and dad the father of magic fubar blow me thanks for following um, all right, I'm going to raid the legacy pit. I'll try to be back on Sunday. Um, likely, I would say. Um, enjoy Travis and company.